Okay, third party app integration, a really exciting new feature with Sirenscape. Ask uh, some questions at support at sirenscape.com or jump on the forums or the Facebook or the Twitter or anything to find out. So yeah, you can actually select from settings and enable third party integration, uh, canceling it with escape or just hitting plus to activate it. And what you can do with this is, let's see, find a mood that you might want to press like nothing unnatural just click it it says link for nothing unnatural copy to the clipboard what that puts in a clipboard is this sort of thing sirenscape fantasy and it's going to run this mood with that wonderful code and so what we can do is we can go to a just a file folder and paste that in as a new shortcut and i'm going to go nothing unnatural unnatural Spelling. Okay, now we've got a shortcut that actually means we can now click on this shortcut. And if we go back to the fantasy player, you see that the nothing unnatural mood has been clicked. I've made several here as well. I've made raining in the witchwood. You can see it's now clicked that mood. I can remotely control Sirenscape. I can even do the same thing with the one shots. So here's some thunder. And I'm going to cancel that and go back here and make a shortcut. Shortcut, paste that URI in there and go thunderclap. Now if I double click the thunderclap, makes a thunderclap, that was more of a roll of thunder, not a clap, I've got clap ones. Now what's really cool is it doesn't matter where I am, I might be in, I don't know, we're somewhere else, so on the high seas, excellent, a good day for sailing. And I can click this thunderclap. And it will still make that thunder happen. So for instance, I could go ship's bell. Because you always need a ship's bell available at all times. I'm going to make a shortcut here. Paste that in there. And go ship's bell. Okay. Now I can be back in the witchwood. Oops, which I, can, I can activate from here. Reading the witchwood. Crossfades just like Sirenscape normally does, as if I've clicked that button. And then I go ship spell. Hey! And a thunderclap. How cool is that? Also, you can control the sci fi play in the same way. Oh, yeah! Light sword on. Where's my sci fi player? Here it is. Yeah, okay. So I've got both players running at the same time. I could hit escape to get back to the normal controls. Pause. Sirenscape there, and you can see. The sci-fi player is now running. I can go light sword plus faster. Now of course you can do this with the custom moves as well. So say I don't like the way that sounds. I don't like it. I'm going to turn the music up a bit and turn everything else down a bit. Nice. Better. Go up to my custom moods here. Turn on enigmatic silence and click Light sword battle with quieter music, which I could actually um, save that obviously in light sword or here or anything. I hit plus to bring up the third part app integration, copy to the clipboard, I bring back this thing, and again go make a shortcut, paste that in, and say, uh, you know, better mix of light sword battle. So now I've got this one. Got this one here. Which has started that that shortcut there. Let's see. Yeah, see that's not running anymore. <laughs> the lasers you can't actually tell the difference between it, you know what I mean? I can go light side off. And of course film <laughs> scream at all times is crucial to have available. So this URI can also be copied into applications. 
Uh, so our wonderful partners at Realmworks will be creating a way that you can create little things you can click on inside Realmworks um, so that you can control Sirenscape remotely without even having to navigate out to it. Anyone building applications can use this function to build in uh, remote control of Sirenscape within their app. I've got some people building some relaxation timer controllers so that all the lovely relaxation sets within Sirenscape can be controlled uh, and just transform every now and then. So I might play a storm for a while and then a time will send one of these signals and transform that storm into a farmland setting or all that sort of thing. I think I've explained it reasonably well in a bit of a randomling way. Congratulations if you're still listening to this. Um, yeah, and as I said, jump on the forum and ask questions and discuss and um, suggest refinements. This is a brand new feature for us that I'm really excited for. And uh, yeah, enjoy. Bye. <laughs>